Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and on today's video, you're going to see just how quick and easy it is to wire up your Series 330 case with the latest in technology from ASUS and their Back to the Future wiring. Keep watching to find out how. So today we're going to be taking a very quick look at how easy it is to wire up your front panel I.O. and all of your power connection to your motherboard, but with them hidden at the back of your case. This is a special feature of the Series 330 and is applicable to some of the modern motherboards out at the moment, such as the ASUS range, the BTF, and also the MSI Project Zero, and potentially will apply to other motherboards that are coming out in the future. So let's get this thing turned off, we'll flip it around the other side, and you can see exactly how easy this is to do. Okay, so this is the back of the Series 330, and all of our connectors are now at the back of the motherboard. So we've got all of our wires here, we've got our power supply, and also other things hanging down. So let's just go through and connect everything up, and we'll try and do this quickly, but I'll try and talk you through the parts at the same time. So we've got a chassis fan header, we've got an address board RGB, we have our pump header, we've also got the fans from our AIO. So that's most of that done, let's move down to the bottom to our front panel IO. So this is really easy, so your our front audio, our front panel connectors for power, reset, hard drive AD, etc, USB 3.0, Now we've got USB-C. And now we can do all of our power connections. So two EPS connections. Our main ATX power. And last of all, 12 volt high power for our graphics card. And there we go. I know it looks a bit of a mess. Obviously you can tidy this up, but that is literally how easy it is to access all of the connections on this motherboard with the Series 330 and the Back to the Future or Back to Front style designs or Project Zero. Very, very nice. And now that we're finished, we've got an absolutely beautifully super clean build. No wires visible. Well, possibly some from the AIO, but they're tucked in away nicely around the heatsink. So basically you can't see any wires. Absolutely fantastic. Hopefully you've liked this video. If you have, smash the like button. If you want to see more content like this on a daily basis, maybe consider hitting subscribe and the chime notification. That way you'll be notified of future video releases. But for now, I've been Mike. This is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To. And hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.